Good morning everyone and welcome back to my channel. Um, sorry for being MIA for the past few weeks. To be honest, I've not been feeling that great and have been suffering with um, some IBD. So if anyone else has that, <laughs> then you'll know how I feel. But um, yeah, enough of that. How are you all? I hope you're well. Um, got some exciting things happening this week in my room. So I'm having some built-in wardrobes put into the eve. So I'm really excited that's starting tomorrow. So I thought I would show you a before and after um, because I've currently been living out of like boxes and things like that. So it's not been the easiest, but very excited to get these wardrobes built and show you what it looks like. So yeah, and then I'll, I'll um, also film putting all my stuff into my wardrobe. So hopefully that'll be fun, but let me quickly show you what the situation is at the moment. You're always there, aren't you? You're always there. So let me quickly show you my current room. Ignore the toy box, that's just to uh, host my TV for the time being. But this was where my current wardrobe was. You can see the mark on the floor Oop. of where the current wardrobe was. So it actually took up such a huge wall um, and made the room feel quite small. But this section here, the eaves, is where the new wardrobes are gonna be. This dressing table will be moved probably to where the old wardrobes were or behind me, which I'm not gonna show you because it's an absolute tip. Um, but yeah, this is gonna move. So this is the current state of the room. I'll try and show you as much as I can. So yeah, I'm very excited to have my wardrobes built in. So they're gonna come out to about here, maybe, like literally where I'm standing, all the way along. So it'll be really lovely. And I'm very excited to, to take you along this journey with me and show you my new wardrobe. Good morning, everyone. So today is Saturday and my wardrobes are built. So I can't wait to show you. Um, I'm literally sat in front of them right now and I love them so much. It makes the room look so much more complete and um, bigger almost, even though four double wardrobes have been built in. So yeah, I'm really excited to show you my new wardrobes. Um, but I just want to top on here and kind of explain why I've been a bit MIA from YouTube um, in case anyone cares. So I have been having what you could call an IBD flare up, um, which has made me feel pretty sh crap to be honest. And all I've been doing is living in trackies and feeling sorry for myself. Um, I am on medication now so quite strong medication which is hopefully going to help and having lots of tests done but yeah that's my excuse for not filming any videos because i've just not really felt like it and um if anyone else suffers with ibd you will understand hopefully and if you do suffer with ibd please let me know anything you do that helps so yeah that's just a little explanation on that but i'm so excited to show you my wardrobes and fill them. So I'm gonna show you now, and I hope you like them as much as I do. Here are my amazing new wardrobes. And here's me in my casual trackies. <laughs> but I'm obsessed. So I went for like a whole matte white finish, oops, um, to kind of blend in with the walls and the ceiling in the eaves. And I think it looks perfect. And um, so I've gone for two mirrored doors, as you can see. And then these cast iron handles, which match my bed. Now, let me show you. They are empty because we're gonna fill them together. So this is what they're like on the inside. Rail along the top, kind of a triangle shelf, which I need to figure out what I'm gonna put on it. Um, hanging and then drawers at the bottom which are quite big and spacious and they're kind of like soft closing, Ooh. soft closing. So I have three double wardrobes like that. I just put um, a cardigan in. As you can see, they're not very high, so long clothes will brush along the bottom. Um, but each wardrobe has a drawer, shelf, 
And then this one, so, so this is Miley's little little corner over here, which I just styled for her. It's not very practical for this video because this door doesn't open properly, so I will have to move it. But this one is where I'm going to be putting my handbags and shoes. Yes, yeah, so it's got a drawer at the bottom there, but I need to move mine in little corner so that I can fill it with you. So I think what I'm gonna do is bring everything from next door, bring it all over and just start filling wardrobes. I have no idea where I'm gonna put anything, but I'm so excited. <laughs> Okay, so as you can see, there's quite a lot of clothes, so I think I'm going to just start by um, put, sorting them through like tops and then colour coordinate and jumpers, dresses, and just see how we get on. Here goes. So I think I'm going to put my dresses in the far wardrobe because they're ones that I don't often wear so they can be like in the furthest one way, <laughs> if that makes sense. Luckily when I unpacked the two wardrobes I had I did everything quite organised so it should be a case of just slotting them in and praying that everything fits. Oh, it won't, but one can hope. Going somewhere up in the clutch. We're going out of ourselves, can you feel it? Almost like I don't know if it's real, cause when we're doing our thing, we're the wheels that won't stop turning. So take me on a trip, 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 nah, trip, trip. We're getting full. This is not a good sign. Oh, I flick the switch, kill the lights. Oh, I wasted. Oh, you're a bit lost, don't you? You're a bit lost. Oh, you're a bit lost. Oh, so, so. Say hello. Say hello. Mm. Do you like my new wardrobes? Hello. Mm. show you what I've done so starting from here this is going to be where I keep all my dresses there's a whole nother two boxes of dresses to come um, but I think I'm gonna go through them and give to charity because I don't really wear them anymore so yeah I can give them away this section here is my jumpers and trousers and then along the top I'm trying to kind of neatly fold a few jumpers to utilize that shelf space but i'm also going to put a basket here and have some jumpers in there and then fold some to put in the drawer and then in this section i need to figure out what to put up here and then this is all my tops and like long sleeved t-shirts and shirts and things again i think i'm going to get a basket under here to put more jumpers in and then i've got this drawer to utilize as well but I just need to figure out what I'm going to put in them. But so far, I am loving it. What do you think? So I actually have a whole chest of drawers that I've neatly folded t-shirts and jumpers into before. So I'm just going to grab the drawers and hopefully just transfer everything into my new drawers here and see how they all fit. I'm just going to show you this drawer because I was insanely proud of how I organised it. If you can see, I folded everything. It looks a little bit messy, but I folded everything so it would fit into it. And it worked so well. But now I need to try and get everything as neatly as 
possible into the new drawers. Okay, so we are now in the new drawers. Oh my god, you're so confused. Oh my god, this is so confused. So I have a whole box I haven't even unpacked, which I'm gonna go through now. So apparently this box is going out dresses. Something I won't need for a while. Now I'm going to do my handbags and my shoes, which I'm excited to do, but also nervous because I hope they all fit. But I've moved Miley's little... Oh, Miley. Why are you looking so sad? Why are you looking so sad? Why are you looking so sad? eyelash glue. Anyone else just find them lying around? God knows how I'm going to get to any of the shoes but we'll figure that one out when the time comes. Bigger bags, does it fit? Mm, no, that's annoying. Okay. Currently, this is how I've done my shoes and handbags. So I've done all the handbags at the front and then like shoes slotted behind. Um, so the idea is I can just like grab my shoes because I think my handbags are prettier than my shoes. And then up here I've had to turn the shoes around to make use of that shelf. And then down here, oops, like boots, handbags. Yeah, again, more like going, I mean, it's a bit messy. <laughs> just shoving it in going out boots, which I won't wear that often. And then down on this section, it's like more nude, summer tones. And then I'm gonna put my underwear in here. This collection of bags. So I still have some, quite a few bits to sort out, but the majority of stuff is in the wardrobe. But I'll start with this wardrobe here, which is more like my going out dresses, day dresses, that kind of thing. So I've got a few handbags in my Louboutins there. Um, what you can't see, is handbags hidden behind the dresses handbags and shoes because there's just not enough space basically and then in this drawer which is all nicely squidged in 
our skirts and shorts. So more like for the summer, but it fits the drawer closes. So that's one wardrobe. But again, I might change this up a little bit. That's that one done. This one is more like my jumpers and I will be hanging more jumpers and more trousers because there's quite a bit of space in there. So essentially these will all be hung once I get more hangers. But again, behind here are handbags, big handbags and just some um, zip hoodies. I love this one from Victoria's Secret. Zip hoodies. And then in this drawer, it's not as tidy as the other one, are tracksuit bottoms which as I said, I have been living in, so I love this straw in particular. Oh, squeeze everything in. So that's that one. And then this one, again, more jumpers, which are gonna be hung. And that'll give me another shelf, which I think I'll probably put my pajamas on, because I have a lot of pajamas. Is t-shirts, shirts, blouses day and night and then down here I've just got two more handbags and then squashed very tightly are just like gym clothes t-shirts everyday clothes needs organizing again but for now I'm just gonna squash them in and forget about it and then this is probably my favorite cupboard because I've always dreamed of having a cupboard like this for my handbags and shoes again needs organizing but ta-da I love it I'm so excited so I've got some shoes here handbags more handbags and then behind I've got trainers and shoes um clutch bags which I've just slotted in behind there you can see and then we go down into like the blacks shoes trainers boots hello <laughs> more handbags and then down here we have more boots heels ones I don't wear that often more handbags and then into the more summery shoes we have sandals at the back boots nude heels nude sandals and yeah that's that and then my underwear which i'm not going to show you <laughs> but this i'm obsessed with so yeah that is my new wardrobe and I love it let me know what you think I hope you've enjoyed this video um, if you have please do like and subscribe and um, I promise I'll be more active on YouTube more frequently <laughs> yeah thank you so much for watching I hope you enjoyed it bye